Hello. Today I want to show you uh, two devices with uh, with a small air pipe for uh, cheating on exam. Uh, these two devices, GSM box with air pipe. This is the model without neck lock, without wire, and this one is uh, the version with uh, with a neck lock. This neck lock you you need to put around your neck. Okay, so uh, what is the difference? Uh, this one without wire can work only with this kind of air pipes. This is skin color air pipes. Okay, so this one can work only with uh, with uh, with uh, this uh, this GSM box without wire can work and with this one with uh, wire but um, the sound is 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 very very high uh, your um, uh, your supervisor can hear from outside so uh, if you want to use this air pipe my my advice is to to not use with neck lock to use without neck lock okay and this one, this is the version with neck lock. Uh, this version can work with uh, magnet, with uh, air pipe, magnet air pipe. Here is a complete set for uh, for magnet air pipe. You have here two type of uh, magnetic air pipe. This one. This one very small, not this. You no need to put this in in air. This one is one size, only one you need to put, and this one is the second one. Okay, this one this one is second one size. Uh, you need to make test, and uh, you need to see after you made test, you need to see which one is more better for you because um, depend the, the your air. You can hear more clear, more okay with this one. Another people can uh, can hear more more okay with this one. Depend the anatomy of the air. Each one uh, person have different air, so you need to make test to see with which one you you hear more more okay. Okay, this one is another kind of magnetic air pipe. The same you have two sides. This one need to touch your air dam. If you, if uh, this one uh, small air pipe not touch your air dam, you you cannot hear nothing in your in, uh, in your air. This one is another version, is another model. This one no need to touch your air dam. Only you need to put inside your air is four. Oh, here we have four. This, this you need to put in one air and this one in second air. Okay, you need to test to see which one uh, you hear more better. And this one is another size. Regular, usual, this kind of air, this small, you, um, uh, you, the person what have the air very small, you will, you will use this. If the, your air is a little more big, you can use this one. You need to make test to see with which one uh, you, you can hear more better. Okay, uh, this black magnet is for uh, um, get out your uh, to plug out the air pipes from your air. Both model and this one and this one uh, small. Okay, you can use this magnet for uh, get out the magnet from your air. Here you have another another tools for can help you to use this device. Uh, this one this one is uh, the same for uh, get out the air pipes from from your air because it's magnetic. Okay, like you can see when you put inside your, your air. Okay, and you want to get out, to plug out, only you need to put like this, okay, and automatically get out. The same and for this one, you can see here is two, okay, let's 
use only one okay you can see and you can uh, uh, plug out the air pipes this one device is a tools for put uh, your uh, to put air pipes inside your air you have to put only one in this tube okay and after you put this in uh, inside your air and when uh, when we make li made like this, the air pipes go di directly in, uh, and touch your air dam. Okay, this is a complete kit for magnetic air pipes. Uh, the advantage of this air pipes uh, is uh, is very small. Okay, and you cannot see inside your air. This kind of uh, air pipes, magnetic air pipes, is very small, but you have this advantage, you need to have this, this neck lob around your neck. Um, this neck lob, you can see below, you can see in video description, uh, you can see uh, another link where you can, you, when you can uh, um, find how to put this neck lob around your neck. It's not so complicated. How to hide them, easy way, easy way to hide them this uh, neck lob. How to use this GSM box? It's very simple, practical. This is a, a, a phone. Uh, you need to put a charge first, okay, with micro USB connector. You need to keep to charging. Okay, I put to charge. Okay, when you put a charge in uh, maximum one minute. Uh, uh, a blue light must flash in here. You need to keep to charging GSM box until um, the light stay all time on, okay, or uh, is turned off. The uh, charging process depend uh, uh, how uh, how um, uh, the battery uh, how your battery is empty. So usual around. Two or three hours, you need to keep to charge. So, please step is to put uh, GSM box to charging. After that, you you need a standard SIM card. Please not put small SIM card, nano or micro. You need a standard SIM card. Okay. You need to put standard. Okay. You can see now it's starting, and immediately need to flashing. Okay. You need to keep to charging until. Uh, uh, a blue light remain all time on. Okay, after you charging, you need to put a SIM card inside. Uh, what is very important, check your SIM card to not have uh, uh, security code. You must disable security code because you uh, this GSM box didn't have a keyboard and you cannot put uh, code for SIM card and uh, the GSM box not pass uh, the step uh, to to enroll the SIM card in the GSM network. So after you charge the GSM box, put the SIM card inside your phone and check the SIM card, the number of the SIM card to be right. And uh, when you start the phone, uh, your phone no need to request any any code. If you request a code, you go to security code menu from your phone and disable this code. After that. Uh, check the SIM card if it's right and if it's working. After that, put SIM card in GSM box. Press short reset button for one second or two seconds and keep press. And after, press on off button and please, uh, please uh, uh, keep pressing for two seconds. Uh, a red light on. After the red light on, you can uh, you can remove the no need to press anymore. But it's very important because you don't know when when the GSM box is on or off because it's made to not have any light when working. So first time you need to press SOS button. When you press SOS reset button, uh, the GSM box go to off, um, and uh, when you press the power button. You sure first is off and after is to you turn on because maybe when you want to turn on maybe GSM box is on and uh, when you press you turn off and you try to to call and uh, um, answer uh, uh, I don't know 
you not JSON box not answer. So first press and keep press one second, two second SOS button and after turn on the GSM box. And you sure with this step GSM box when you press the power button you sure you turn on. After you turn on wait around one minute and after you can call the SIM card number uh, uh, from inside GSM uh, what you put inside GSM box. Uh, GSM box automatically answer every time when your helper call the SIM card number from here. It's very important to to have a new SIM card because uh, each time when, uh, for example, if uh, if I uh, if I have a call with uh, now with this GSM box, and if someone call me, uh, GSM box turn off the the call uh, now and answer to the last one who call. So it's very important to. To um, the SIM card number to nobody know your number. So get a SIM, a new SIM card number. Okay. Uh, after that, you need to put the battery inside the inside AirPies. I will show you the right position how to put the battery. Okay. The the battery has two sides. This side is with some words, and another another uh, uh, side with this. Uh, I don't know tell you, <laughs> but you can see this side with this side si cycle on the here. Okay, and here you have with some words. You you can put like this. Okay, with words in in in. Uh, inside the, the the cover like this okay not like this like this is not okay like this is okay okay and after you make like this okay and from this moment the battery uh, go to empty okay so um, please put the battery until to go to exam and the same for for the GSM box. Um, after you, uh, my uh, my advice is to unplug from charging until to go to exam because uh, um, to have uh, a lot of autonomy. Uh, when uh, the out, the battery lifetime is around uh, three point uh, uh, half three three hour and a half. Um, and but in continue uh, in if you stay all time in the call um, in standby you have a lot of autonomy some like two days or some like this okay this is for uh, a version without wire the version with with wire with neck lock, uh, is very similar how to use the same you need to put a charge press reset button turn on button uh, you put this you you can find uh, uh, in described in description you can find a link where you can see how to e easy way to to mount the the neck loop around your neck and um, uh, you need to put neck loop around your neck and it's the same you put uh, this you can choose you, you may test and you can choose which one air pies you want to 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 use okay and this is all the same when your helper call the sim card number gsm box automatically answer and send the voice inside your air the hour uh, the battery lifetime is the same is around uh, three hour and a half um i don't know how to tell you more anymore i think this is all